Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. Yes, it's that time again. Time to rank up some more champions. I got another double rank up for you today. And these two, one of them, uh, it's been a very long time coming. And the other one, it's just been a long time coming. And, well, I'll talk a little bit more about it when we uh, get there. So if you think you can guess who I'm about to take up, both of them, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Miles Morales. So that's the first one that I'm going to be taking up in this video. And this one, it's been a very long time coming. And I actually had to work on this one. Let me tell you. All right. Um, I went through my resources and I had the T5 basics. But as you're going to see in a little bit, I neglected to look for one very essential um, requirement uh, resource here. But uh, Xander Scar, <clears throat> where you at, man? Uh, if you see this, shout out to you. Xander Scar is another uh, YouTuber, and he absolutely loves Miles Morales. And it's actually because of him uh -oh. that we are here today ranking this guy up. I saw what he was able to do with Miles Morales a long time ago. And ever since I got Miles Morales, I was like, you know what? He looks like he's worthy. I think I'll take him up. So, fast forward. Uh, you can see here, I'm trying to get a science. I missed a science T5 catalyst to take him up. Had everything else. So, you see, I'm desperate here. I'm trying to get a science to form. And you saw when I popped the other ones, nothing. Hey, got a skill. That's not what I needed. I need a science. And I'm just popping everything. Oh, two catalysts formed. And we got it. I was not sure I was going to get it. And I was about to be mad. Because I would have had to have delayed the video and everything. And I just wouldn't have been happy. Okay. But anyway, uh, what I was saying was that because of Xander Scar... And his showcasing of Miles Morales. I wanted to take him up. But we had just so many other science champions uh, that took priority over him. They, they just did. Not necessarily because they were just better. Sometimes they were just new and shiny. And I could see myself using them. Like Titania. Titania was new. But she doesn't gain buffs. So I could use her in war. She's tanky, and she didn't get buffs. So I'm like, yes, perfect, okay? Uh, and you've seen me use her in war if you've watched my war videos. Um, we had I-Bomb. We've had so many other Quicksilver. I mean, I saw Quicksilver. He had the prestige, and he looked like he was a ton of fun, and he is. So I had to take him up. Then we had Scorpion. Scorpion. Oh, man, he's one of my favorite uh, science champions, along with uh, Quicksilver, you know. Um, and then uh, Hulk got a rework. And so we had to take him up, of course. Um, so it's been a while to do this guy justice. Now, I don't know how to use him to the best of his ability. Uh, that's Xander Scar. But I'll probably go back and look over some things and see uh, what we can do with this guy. All right. So that was the first one. Now, the second one for the video is going to be Sorcerer Supreme. Now, first things first, I run the damage masteries, the recoil masteries. And she is not 
friendly with those masteries. However, you can play her in such a way that it's not quite as bad, but she needs to throw specials to ramp up her damage and you don't want to do that. But you do have some regen possibilities with her. Um, one of the reasons that I took her up, I saw a video where she was used in war and she was doing some work. Okay. And I've done a video on her a long time ago. Uh, back when I was still making those videos uh, where we did like a closer look or a deep dive uh, into these champions. And uh, she was very, very good. And seeing her, you know, more current being used, because I hadn't seen her used, um, it, it reminded me of how good she is. And she is good. Um, she on on certain nodes, she can also be very, very annoying as a defender. I remember fighting her, but of course, we've got human torch. They'll just tear her up. Um, but without a proper counter, she can be annoying, especially on like a power gain node. If they're running mystic dispersion. Oh, my goodness. She can be a royal pain. OK, um, but. I'm probably not going to end up using her a ton, but I wanted to have her ranked up because she is a good tool to have. Now, she is the one that I said it's been a long time coming because she was already ranked two. And I had planned to take her to rank three. But that was a long time ago. She's been sitting at rank two. A lot of champions I have not too many, um, probably about eight, I would say eight or seven, um, are at rank two right now. And some of them are not going to rank three anytime soon uh, because things have changed. The game has changed. Meta has changed. Things like that can happen. Um, but for her, I just wanted to get her up there. Uh, like I said, even with my masteries, playing her in a certain way to, to trigger her regeneration, she can still be very usable with the damage masteries. All right, so we'll head into Realm of Legends against Winter Soldier for a little bit, uh, not for really, really long. Uh, like I said, I made a video on her uh, before, and uh, for Miles, I'm just going to do a quick, uh, showcase because if you want to see how to use him, go to Xander Scar's page. Just search for it. It's X Xander, not a Z. X A N D E R Scar. Anyway, let's head on to uh, Realm of Legends. All right, so we're going to go in with these synergies here. Let's take a look at these synergies. All right, so the first one is the Spider-Verse Mentors. Spider challenges are slightly easier to complete. Seems like a nice thing there. And plus 7% health. Sounds good. Uh, the next one, Spider-Sense charges grant plus 5 attack rating. So more damage. Uh, plus 7% attack rating uh, for all synergy champions. Does not stack with duplicate synergies. So don't try to add on all of these guys here thinking you're going to get what 28 percent not going to happen all right now once again don't look to me for you know spider-man uh miles morales gameplay but we're gonna do what we can do Loving the crits already, though. So I'm a little um, confused about how that's supposed to work. I guess it's supposed to be... Um, I'll have to look into him. But, like, I'll... Uh, 
expect it to just, you know, go through. And I get hit sometimes. Like that. So, I need to... I guess maybe his signature level needs to be up. But his damage ain't no joke, though. Like, see right there? I just kind of let it um, hit me instead of try to block. Okay, that worked out a little bit better. I just blocked. Yeah, that looks a little bit better. Already learning. Yeah, already learning. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. I just got to learn him a little bit. I wished I had had him ranked up for the um, the challenge in uh, the Karina challenge. All right. So that's all we're going to do for him. Now we're going to bring in uh, Sorcerer Supreme. We'll see what um, synergies uh, she's got. Um, let's see. That could be useful. And look at that. Two of the new ones that I got, too. Um, uh, da, 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 passive prowess. That, that could be useful, too. It's paused. Okay, that one... For this fight, anyway. Mm, block penetration could be fun. Stun debuffs last longer. Well, that could be useful. Um, armor breaks inflicted have 30% increased potency. Hmm. Let's, uh, let's do this one. Bring in Hulk! Now, I need to look at her really quickly because it's been so long. And I wanted to show, let's see. Yep, notice her basic attacks, energy damage. Um, but yeah, these blessings is what I wanted to remember. And the one that um, we want, really is the runes of Aragador because of the damage uh, masteries that I have on. So heavy attacks rotate to the next blessing. And let's see, Aragador. All right, let's, let's jump in here. I might remember as I start playing Let's see if I remember. So one of the things I want to do, I want to get to a special three. Okay, this is Ragador's Resolve. All right, starting to remember, starting to remember. Okay, so at this point, Let's switch. No, no, no. Let's try that again. Switch. Okay. I believe this is the one that will give the uh, regen. Let's find out if I remember correctly. Looks like it. See that regen? Look at that. Okay, now. If I remember, this one is the damage. And we're just going to skip that. Uh, 
Okay. I'm starting to remember this. She's not going to be the fastest fighter, but if you'll notice, even with the damage masteries, I still have a decent amount of health. Okay, let's, um... Oh, he wants to play. Okay, let's hit him with that one. He went and, and didn't attack me. Trying to catch me out there. Okay, I took all that into my block. And it didn't matter. Look at that. All that regen. And see, I'm not playing her quite the way that I should. See, look at this. Boom. Because if I remember correctly, the more uh, specials, it ramps up her damage. But because I'm in uh, running the damage masteries, that also hurts. Me. He's got a lot of utility. She is just awesome. But since I run those damage masteries. But I could have taken the fight slower. And I would have had more of my health left. So I don't have to spam specials with her. I could rotate the special threes. And, you know, maybe throw a special here and there. And she would be just fine. All right. But anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.